Hi, I'm Isaac from Isaac Builds Things, and in this quick video, my riving knife on my DeWalt job site table saw is out of alignment when I just got it out of the box, so I'm gonna adjust that and show you how I do it. DWE7491. This is the 2000 watt model, so it's the big one for the job site table saws, so I'm not sure if this will be transferable for the other models, but at least you'll be sorted for the 2000 watt model. Something else to double check before adjusting your arriving knife is that your blade is actually in line with your fence. So you, you need your fence to be aligned really parallel with your blade for it to cut straight as well, obviously. So mine was lined up, so it was just the arriving knife that needed adjusting. So the tools we're gonna need for this are metric Allen keys, the four millimeter and two millimeter. So the first thing you want to do is remove the throat plate. So you just twist that and then pull it out. Super easy. And make sure that your blade is wound up to full height. So we're going in behind the blade. The riving knife gets clamped on by this clamp. And the clamp has adjustable screws. We've got two bottom screws, which are the four millimeter Allen keys. And this screw and this screw are the top screws and they are the two millimeters. So the four millimeter Allen keys, the bottom two, these ones need to be opened up to loosen the clamp, and then the two millimeter and the two millimeter need to be loosened or tightened depending on what way the writhing knife is on the blade. So to check which way we actually want to adjust the writhing knife, get a straight edge, bring it up, touch it on a tooth at the front edge and a tooth at the back edge, and we can see there's a big gap on this side. So the riving knife is too far to the right. That's because I over adjusted it. So it used to be too far to the left, but I've way over adjusted it. So now we've got the two screws down there. The four millimeters are loosened. And then we're gonna get our two millimeter screw and we're going, two millimeter Allen key, and we're going to adjust it anti-clockwise, which will let the riving knife travel back to the left to straighten it out. So I'm gonna go anti-clockwise to push the riving knife left. First up, I actually went clockwise to pull the riving knife over, and that was too much. So depending on which way you go, you wanna anti-clockwise, anti-clockwise, lefty loosey, righty tidy. That will push the riving knife to the left, and clockwise will push the riving knife to the right. So I've gone back and forth a few times, getting this perfectly lined up so that now when we line it up, there's no gap. Well, there's a tiny gap between when it's touching the blade and then not touching the writhing knife on either side. So that's how you adjust your writhing knife on your DeWalt 2000 watt table saw. Thanks for watching. If you've got any other um, adjustments or anything you need, comment down below what you want to see next. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.